Hi, my name is Francoise, and today I want to help you save your time by showing you the best free software you can use to draw your uh, 3D objects for your 3D printing. So far, I found that uh, using, uh, using Fusion 360 is the best all-around program for your 3D drawing. It can handle both your straight lines and also curves. Uh, when I got excited about 3D printing, I went to get my AutoCAD certificate, but I found that, uh, that AutoCAD was a heavy program and it wasn't really made for 3D printing. Uh, of course, when you have AutoCAD, you can also download and, um, the, um, and, uh, the export STL plugin, but uh, AutoCAD is expensive and, um, and um, and it was just what what not a it's it's not what I needed for the stuff I need to do at home. Uh, then I used a SketchUp SketchUp Make uh, because it was simple and free. Uh, for so for a while it was it was okay, but I was getting frustrated because I couldn't get my curves in. Uh, so Fusion 360 um, is really easy to make beautiful objects and it's very versatile. Um, I would suggest studying the Fusion 360 tutorials to speed up your learning curve and uh, get a glimpse of its potential. I also found on YouTube, Product Design Online for Absolute Beginners is a great exercise to start uh, drawing. If you need to do some freehand drawing, uh, Inkspace lets you uh, open your scan drawing, converts it into a uh, vector base and then uh, you can save it. As a plotting file that can you can you can open up on Fusion 360 uh, for uh, personal use and it will recognize it. Uh, so here um, you're seeing me on Inkspace. I'm uh, tracing uh, my signature, and uh, then I'm separating all the all the layers to get to the 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 best the best layer that uh, I, f I found there was less uh, holes in it that was the original I have I had one more layer in there I to scoot that over Okay, I like the bottom signature the best. Okay, I like that one. So, took out the extra nodes and then uh, saving it. Save as. And that's what's important saving it as plotting DXF. Bernardin signature. Okay, and. So you open up uh, Autodesk Fusion 360, and you can uh, open it. You go open from my computer. DXF, and that's how easy Fusion 360 is. It already knows that I want these to be objects, so I'm selecting everything. And uh, I'm going to extrude it to uh, 0.5 centimeters. There you go. There's my 3D object. So I decided to do is uh, what's fun. Like what you can do with it is that you can you can take two bodies two objects together and in the extrude um, let's see you gonna select it yeah I don't know why I selected it twice I selected it twice all right I should have uh, done the extrude a little bit uh, higher up, doesn't matter. And then extrude and operation is cut. And then it gets cut, it gets cut and you'll see how a great, uh, it's like a cookie cutter. 
and his Fusion 360 is great. Thanks for watching, and uh, till next project.